Okay everybody, as promised, this is a video vlog for my birthday celebration 2023. It's long delayed because my original birthday was November 2nd, but we didn't get around to celebrating it until today, so... Anyway, I'm going to show off some of the things I got for presents for my birthday. And, uh, hope you guys enjoy it. So, there you go. First things first, I will show you the books. Now, who doesn't like Rick Mercer? I mean, he's just one of the funniest comedians Canada's ever produced. Just watch Made in, Made in Canada. This hour has 22 minutes. And, of course, the Rick Mercer report. And you will see how down-to-earth and funny he really is. So I got Rick Mercer report the book. That's the first one. I also got Rick Mercer final report from my parents. So these complete my Rick Mercer collection. I have already in my possession talking to Canadians and um, a nation worth ranting about, which are his other books. So these will be fun reads. And now on to the DVDs. Quite a treasure trove, if you ask me. First question, have you all, any of you heard of Don Knotts? Bless his heart, he was one of the most gifted comedians in the world. Most people know him for playing Barney Fife on the Andy Griffith show. But, uh, yeah, he's, worth, he's much more than that. And these movies in this collection prove it. Yeah, this is, this is some of his work at Disney. It has The Apple Dumpling Gang, The Apple Dumpling Gang Rides Again, Hot Lead and Cold Feet, and Gus, where he's paired with a funny donkey. <laughs> of all people, or stars, I should say. Yeah, it was really funny, those movies, and it shows how versatile he is as an actor. Next DVD. And this is from the same family of shows. It was a spin-off of the Andy Griffith show. Gomer Pyle, USMC. Jim Neighbors is brilliant in this. I can't rave enough about this show. He drives Sergeant Carter batty. <laughs> yeah. This one is from when I was a kid. Many people may remember this show. Um, it's about an alien wise guy that comes to live with a family on Earth. Elf. Ha, I killed me. <laughs> yeah, this particular set that I got has the original four seasons, plus the spin-offs, Elf the Animated Series and Elf Tales, plus new feature, special features with the co-creators of Elf. It was just released this year. And final DVD set, this one's for my grandparents. The Show About Nothing. <laughs> yeah, I always loved Seinfeld. George Costanzo was my favorite character just because he was so neurotic. It was not even funny. Yeah, I mean, just some of the situations they get themselves in there are funny. Beyond belief. That's why they call it a show about nothing, because it's about real life. And the endless material that Jerry concocts for his stand-up act from real life just blows your mind. Yeah, I got that for my birthday. All those DVDs, plus the books. And my stepfather gave me his old Mac Mini, so I got a new computer out of it, too. Yeah, it works wonders, too. And my grandmother in Guelph got me a uh, monitor, keyboard, and mouse to go with it. So I got spoiled rotten for my 43rd birthday, if you know what I mean. Yep. Yeah, so I'll tell you guys how my day went. Well, I got up this morning around 10 o'clock or 10.30, went for a walk, uh, came back, had my shower, and then just chilled most of the day. And after that, I had lunch around 2 o'clock, nice bologna sandwich. And then around 6.30, we went to uh, Boston Pizza for supper, my old stomping grounds where I used to work. And uh, I got treated to a uh, free meal because I used to be an employee there. They don't do that for everybody, you know. But I guess they really liked me when I worked there. I put 13 years of my life in there, so I guess that was worth something. I appreciate it nonetheless. Just goes to show that some people go the extra mile for people even in these tough times. It was nice seeing all my old co-workers again, too. 
I was beyond blessed for that. Something I'll never forget. Yeah. And as you can see, I got a haircut the other day. I, I didn't like my long hair, you know. I was starting to look like Long John Baldry. <laughs> or should I say Baldy? <laughs> yeah. Anyhow, that was my day in a nutshell. We just got home a few minutes ago. So, and here I am making this vlog now. I'll probably go to bed after watching TV for a bit. And, yeah, until tomorrow. Alright, until the next vlog, I'll see you guys later. Peace.